<laughs> all right, all right. What's going on, party people? This your man, Griff. Uh, just started washing some clothes. It's about 11 something at night. Uh, what time is it? Oh, midnight. My bad. It's midnight. Um, so, washing some clothes. And, you know, a lot of times, depending on where you live at, but a lot of times they charge you less on electricity when you wash your clothes between 10, in the, 10 at night and I think like 5 in the morning. So a lot of times I wash my clothes in late in the evening. I hope that's true. <laughs> Instead of being up late washing clothes, I could be asleep. But um, I'm about to go up here, finish doing my NNA um, signing agent training course, the video part. And um, what else I got to do? I think, yeah, do the test. And then I got to prep two sets of documents. Um, I think I got three tomorrow. Yeah, I got three tomorrow and I got six on Friday. Um, tomorrow's what, Thursday? Yeah, so tomorrow's Thursday, then six on Friday. I ended up with five today. Started off with three. And um, an appointment that was for yesterday got moved to the day. Didn't know it was going to be moved to the day, but it popped up. We got that done. And then um, I picked up a 530 appointment for a couple. Um, apparently, they had a family emergency yesterday, so they couldn't do it yesterday. And I ended up catching that order to do today. So, um, yeah. So... Also, I did put the links in the video from last night, the live, so go check it out. I put three links up there. I hope I re those are all the links. If for some reason I'm missing a link that I said I was going to put up there to something, please <laughs> let me know. Just make a comment and say, hey, Griff, you forgot this or whatever, and I'll, go put, and I'll put it in there. Um, I don't have time to go back and look at the videos, so um, I might have forgot what missed something but i think i got the three that i remember talking about if i miss something please 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 let me know um yeah it's man it's just so much i could talk about right now but i'm not i'm tired and i gotta go do finish the stuff that i was doing but um one of the things i wanted to mention real quick is um one of the one of the viewers subscribers talked about the fact that they're ready to start taking orders Excuse me. And <clears throat> and they said the only issue is that they're getting orders um, same day or next day. And, <clears throat> and right now, that is the bulk of the orders that are coming through. Um, why? The legitimate reason why? I have no idea. I have no idea whatsoever. I have no reason. I don't know any specific but jimmy like hey this is truly the reason why the only thing i can think of is that a lot of these companies are short staff and it's taking them some time to get the documents together oh, excuse me and that's causing delays um there's like matter of fact you know sometimes it could be a delay in the person reviewing documents meaning the signers and some of the companies are putting in place that before they can proceed to closing the signers have to review the documents and sometimes the documents don't get reviewed till the day of by the signers and therefore then they're like okay let's close and they gotta close because it's the last day of the rate lock and all kinds of other stuff or some kind of incentives if it's a purchase or a sale they probably got to sell today because if not interest rates you know i'm um, not the interest rate but um certain um amenities or they you know they just got to move out of the house because they made a, it was in a contract or whatever so they just got to do it right now and we are going to have to find a way to be ready for that we got to find a way to be able to move when they ask us to that's why i keep saying the number one way to market your business is to be ready to do business and if you know things are coming last minute, now you got to put together a plan and say, there's a high chance that when I wake up tomorrow morning, 60% of the orders I get are going to be for same day or next day. What is prohibiting me from taking them same day or next day? What's in my way? And is it something that can be fixed? Is it something that can be moved or what have you? Now, if it's fear, if it's apprehension, 
you're going to have to figure that one out. <laughs> you really are. But if it's neither one of those and it's like you actually are working a job, family stuff, whatever, then you're going to have to try to find a way around it. Maybe get another babysitter, maybe, you know, something. Um, you're going to have to, even if you decide, okay, two days out of the week is when I'm going to be able to just do nothing but notary stuff. No matter if it comes in the same day, I'll do it. You got to start figuring it out. If you don't, you're going to be sitting on the sideline fussing about you haven't done anything and it's been a year. So, and this isn't just to the young lady who um posed the question or made the statement. It's for everybody and it's for me. Unfortunately, when I first started, there's no videos of me talking about it because I wasn't on YouTube. I was just out here doing the work. I was just taking whatever came, figuring it out, saw the way my job was, saw how I can go do my loan closings and still support my W-2 properly and be within the confines of my contract with them. And I did that, you know, and I did that for what, <coughs> at least two and a half years. And, um, and I was very successful with it, which put me in a position to do it full time. And I've been successful with it, you know, as a full time notary. So, this is just something y'all going to have to take time out and figure out because if not, you're just going to be sitting on the sidelines frustrated that you're not getting any orders. We can't control when they come. All we can control is whether or not we respond saying we're available. And then when we get assigned, go do it. Um, but you, you'll be amazed. You'll be surprised at the doors that get open once you start just taking an order, even though it might be slightly inconvenient for you, for you. But if in reality you really can do it, then go do it. And that's how I look at it. That's why, I mean, the order came in, and the way it happened today, I was already booked for 3, 9 o'clock, 11 o'clock, 2 o'clock. Then all of a sudden I get a notification for one at 5.30. I said, no problem. I ain't got nothing going on. I'll do 530. Then I get a phone call saying, hey, the one from yesterday is not today. What time? 430. <laughs> I was like, whoo. But I made it work. Everything worked out and got everybody done and got the documents shipped out on time. It was too close, but I got them shipped out on time, got scan backs done, all that's been uploaded, and I made it happen. So... You want to have you got some decisions to make, and when I say this, I'm I mean I'm sincere. You, me, we got decisions to make as to how we're going to be in a position to do this business when the opportunity comes. That's all it is. So let me let me know what you think in the comment section. Thanks for hitting the like button, sharing, and subscribing. Really appreciate each and every one of y'all. As y'all can see, I am sleepy, and I'm about to fall asleep right on y'all. <laughs> And I'm trying not to, so, but I got to go up here and finish doing my doc prep and get everything else together. So I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.